So this is my minimalist setup for an iPhone. I have made a whole video about it and it works pretty good. But how does it work on the Mac? Well, not so good. So don't take this video too seriously. But I still think that it's good to know how to change the folder icons and app icons on the Mac. Well, you can easily change the folder icons on the Mac. You simply right click the folder, select get info and now drag the new custom icon all the way to the top here. Now you have a custom folder, but Mac doesn't allow you to change the icons for the applications. Let me show you. I can just go to my applications folder, drag any icon to the desktop. It will automatically create an alias that's useful. So I can play with this icon without messing anything around. Now I will use the same technique, right click it, open get info and then drag new custom icon over there. At the first look, it seems that it works. But look at this, when you take it and drag it all the way down to the dock, it will change again to the original icon. By the way, you can download all of these folder and app icons for free. I will leave a link for it in the description below. But now let's have a look at the dock. If I want to get the custom icons into the dock. Well, it's quite a lot of steps how to do it. But I'll show you now the whole setup. First of all, open the shortcuts app. Here, click on the plus button to create a new shortcut and simply search for open app command and add it to the script. Here, you need to select application you want. I already have few of them created, so I can try maps this time. Name it maps on top, but you don't need to bother about changing the icon here. Now close the editor and right click the newly created shortcut. In this menu you will find option to edit into the dock. I'm doing this step just to find the location of the icon in the finder. Because under the right click menu, I can reveal it in finder to find the exact location of this icon. Of course you can skip this step if you already know where to find these icons. But I like this option, it's really easy to find it. Now I can use the same setup as before. Right click the icon, open the info and again drag the icon here. The icon is changed but it doesn't automatically change it in the dock. So you need to remove it from the dock and then drag the new one there. Now it is all fine. Maybe you know a better way how to do it. You can write me about it in the comments below. But it just works fine for me. The only issue is that it's not the app itself. It's just a shortcut to it. So when you click on the icon in the dock, it will open the real app right next to it, ruining that minimalistic style. But if you really like this kind of style, I made a similar video how to achieve that on an iPhone. You can watch it right here and I think it works really good. Anyway, if you like this video, give it a like, subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one.